bus flight to the finish line. These things are fast. We got one up to 130 kilometers an hour. Feeling the rush of an elevated competition. CTV National News. Amazing. After the break, things are still going up in the air. We're off to the drone races, a thrilling mix of high tech and high anxiety. We leave you tonight with a story that could leave your head spinning. It's called drone racing, and it's an extreme sport that sort of looks like NASCAR meets Star Wars. It started as a niche hobby about two years ago, and since then has spiraled into big business. Here's CTV's Kevin Gallagher with more on the game of drones. Once a month, this go-kart track in Montreal is invaded by the latest racing craze. These things are fast. We've got one up to 130 kilometers an hour. High-performance drones, controlled from a first-person perspective. So that's the camera through which you can see with your goggles. Information from an onboard camera is transmitted to the pilot's goggles, giving racers a unique sensation. Uh, it's like you're flying. All of a sudden, you'll fly past yourself, and you'll go, whoa, that was me. Pilots feel the adrenaline rush of each twist and turn, and see the impact of each crash. Luckily, the carbon fiber bodies are durable. Because you only see this, the world through this camera, right? And so when you turn around, you need to know where the obstacle is without looking at it. Drone racing is increasing in popularity around the world, with pilots from Montreal being invited to the first world championships in Dubai. He's going a little long down there. He dubbed the World Drone Prix. Organizers flew some of the best pilots from across the globe to Dubai last March. A million dollars in prize money was up for grabs. It's fast-paced. It's like F1 racing. I'm sourcing spaces right now. A high-profile comparison and a surprise for the racers who started Montreal's league. We were just a bunch of guys meeting up at a cafe, actually, and just seeing if this was going to work. A core group that continues to grow as this new sport takes flight. Kevin Gallagher, CTV News, Montreal. And that is how we end I'm on TV! Woo! Team Zero Thrust, FPB Montreal, that is awesome! Woohoo!